Hello everybody, I'm Mana, and we're back with more Detroit Become Human. When we last left off, we were with Connor, and I, I, um, I shot Chloe. I don't feel good about that. At all. Don't, no, nope, nope, don't feel good about it. Uh, <laughs> we are picking up with, I believe, Kara, Alice, and Luther, and I believe this is a, a, um, crossroads chapter where they... A couple of them intersect, if not all of them. Uh, so yeah. We are getting close, I think, to the end of the game where we're just gonna start having longer chapters, more crossovers, and all that fun stuff. So, um, actually I can cheat and find out for you. Freedom! Oh, nope, it's just... Okay, it's all just... Um, Marcus. Okay, I'm gonna quit looking at that for now. Sorry, <laughs> let's just let's just jump into it, okay? <laughs> Getting ahead of myself. Android Riot, Detroit neighborhoods vandalized by psychotic machines. Global population reaches 10 billion. U.S. life expectancy now 91. The Eastern Space Race, Russia and China's androids face off. VR MMORPG reaches 1 billion users. Florida. Okay. I mean, I like the piano. Not that I know how to play. And you go out on the ledge anyway, so. I was wondering where you were. I needed to think. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people, and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Yesterday? When we set fire to that place? Ugh. All that... Chaos, the flames. In that moment, I enjoyed it. The power, the violence. And I hate myself for feeling that way. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. 
Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. It's too late to go back now. We have to finish what we started and just hope that reason prevails. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? Who I was is not important. What matters now is who I want to be. We won't question North's past. Where are you going? To talk to the humans. Sorry, North. Had to make some changes. This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus, it's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Funny that the Marcus, role's reversed. Please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. Okay, there are no androids behind me currently. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. You're free. Come with us. You're awake now. Am I missing any? I don't think I'm missing any. You're free now. Hey! Where do you think you're going? Leave him alone. He's chosen to be free. No, no. Don't you put me on hold. I need to block the street. Mm. Wakey, wakey. You're free. You don't have to obey them. You're free. Well, I think I've grabbed everyone. Everybody up. You 
free now. I'm just like trying to scan back and forth to make sure I don't miss anybody. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. No, thank you. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. Maybe a little. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us, we can take them. If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand their ground, even if it means dying here. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed!
Don't do it, Marcus. Don't choose confrontation. Too late. Follow me! the first time but I did say I was going violent this time so I need to stop sparing people as much as I hate that I hate how that sounds <sighs> this is not the way I like to play public opinion though is gonna go down a lot down very harshly. Some. I still don't know why my internet won't stay connected to the fucking PS4. 80%. Alright. Oh, it didn't even give me the option to share memories. I did, you know, leave, though. So.
Oh, I apparently missed an android. My B, I was trying to find everyone. Uh, we charged. We didn't get that other option. I've never left before, so... But we won the fight. The police retreated. And Marcus defeats the police. We lost the fight. More stuff happens. Good to know. John did not give his life to save me this time. John may have died regardless. Sorry, John. Uh, <laughs> that is it for this chapter of Detroit Become Human. Um, it, it, I, I'm a very empathetic person, and if I can do things peacefully, I usually go that route. So it's very difficult for me to, to go to the violent route on this one. Like, I, I just, I want to sp spare, spare, spare. Don't. You're not allowed to. You, you, you chose to do the violent run on Marcus. You gotta do the violent run. And it, just, it hurts me. It hurts me so much. <laughs> so, um, I'm gonna call it here. And I think the next one is Kara, Allison, Luther. But I could be wrong, as that is 100% possible with the beginning of this episode literally being a direct example of that. So, um, I am going to call it here and I will see you guys later. Until then, do something nice for a stranger today. You just might save life. Bye!